The federal court denied an appeal by former Prime Minister Najib Raza and his son Nasifuddin to quash the summary tax judgments against the duo. The top court made a ruling after dismissing the father and son's appeal to quash the High Court's decision on grounds that the appeal has no merit. This means that Najib and Nasifuddin need to settle 1.69 billion ringgit and 37.6 million ringgit in unpaid taxes and penalties respectively. The duo's appeal hinge on their contention that Section 106, Bracket 3 of the Income Tax Act 1967 is invalid for contravening Article 121 of the Federal Constitution. Article 121 is in relation to the powers of the judiciary in Malaysia. In reading out the unanimous verdict on behalf of the Apex bench, fellow member Judge P. Nalini said those who owed LHDN must settle the outstanding amount before making an appeal. However, Nalini said Najib and his son can still bring their case for reassessment before the non-judicial body Special Commissioners of Income Tax, SCIT. When met by reporters today, Najib's lawyer, Mohamed Shafi Abdullah, said the duo can still be declared as bankrupt before going to SCIT. See, the whole idea of SCIT, this court itself took note, is to provide the complete hearing and the decision. But if the tax department wants to bankrupt him now without giving him the full right, then what the federal court is saying here becomes completely nonsensical. Complete nonsense. Yeah? So that's why we want to see what is the full judgment.